see, everything that's natural is good for you, right? No, no, not really. I mean, there's poisonous plants, there's poisonous insects, there's poisonous animals like snakes, and there are poisonous minerals. And they're perfectly natural, but they're really dangerous. And today we're going to talk about deadly and dangerous minerals. And now, these kind of minerals, they, uh, they are often found in and around old mining areas and that kind of stuff. And so if you're looking for crystal specimens or things like that that are interesting, and, and they can be beautiful and valuable, but you better know what's deadly and what's not. And that's why we're going into this. So you can be aware not to lick rocks or, you know, and people think, well, I don't lick rocks. But the truth is, you could even handle, you know, ores with lead in it and get some dust on your hands and then you eat a sandwich or something and you know the dust gets into your mouth and you eat it and the truth is with a lot of these heavy metal uh, types of minerals the the poison like lead gets into your body and your body doesn't really get rid of it it stays around for a long time now I've gone over 10 classes of uh, dangerous minerals uh, there are actually more than this these are the most common and well-known ones uh, but it's easy to forget when we're out in nature uh, how potentially dangerous certain kinds of minerals are. Especially this is true if you're looking around old mining areas in old mine dumps and that kind of stuff for crystal specimens and mineral specimens because you know some of these specimens can be valuable and it's not unusual for prospectors to go looking for valuable mineral specimens. Even specimens of realgar and orpiment, which are, you know, deadly arsenic minerals, the specimens have value, and if handled with care, they're not going to, you know, they don't jump off the uh, specimen and poison you. Uh, so you got to handle all this stuff with care. Uh, you know, I've said multiple times about washing your hands, about being careful about dust. You don't want to breathe dust. Uh, in any kind of place where you've got lead, or uh, antimony, mercury, of course, asbestos, uranium, thorium, all these things and other minerals have potential to be dangerous. So care is required. I have lots of information about gold and geology, gemstones, and other related things. Come on over to my channel and learn to find your own gold. Chris Ralph, Professional Prospector, the most informative prospecting channel on YouTube.